You, you ever feel like a broken record, like you're having deja vu over and over and over again? Like, honestly, I wish this was just deja vu, but the Jaguars just keep on losing games. Today, the Jaguars often scored one touchdown. That's all, folks, just, just one touchdown, all of it total. And honestly, look, that's a reflection of Doug Peterson. Let's flashback to when Doug Peterson was hired. It feels like such a long time ago, but he did say, calling plays, that's something I pride myself in. I will say right now that I want to call the plays. I want to put myself in a position to help this football team. Feels like forever ago, doesn't it? Such a long time, one eternity ago, because fast forward to now, the Jaguars' offense is hopeless, and Doug isn't even calling plays. It's just such a long time ago, almost as long as the last time the Jaguars' offense looked like it was clicking. So now, every time we ask questions about the Jaguars' offense, it kind of it feels like a broken record, you know? Look, again and again, we just love the repetition of words like, be better, and we just have to execute. And those are all nice ways to say for guys that they don't want to throw somebody under the bus for messing up, and that's fine. But then Doug Peterson gets asked about what happened on a play late in the game, and this is his response. Um, yeah, I'm not going to go through the details of the play because you guys wouldn't figure it out. But um, we, we wouldn't figure it out. Look, I got news for you, Coach. It doesn't look like you got it figured out either. Or should we check the scoreboard on that one again? Seven points. And he wants to throw shade and say, we can't figure something out? They scored less points than Phillip Rivers has kids. He has 10 kids. Doug Peterson needs to go back to the drawing board and try and figure it out himself. He has a lot of things he needs to work on. How about he figure out how to get Brian Thomas Jr. involved in the offense? It's like having a Bugatti parked outside. He has, over the last two weeks, had seven targets combined. Combined. They've had players on the Jaguars roster that have gotten more than that in each one of the games. That should be a crime. Look, miss me with the we wouldn't figure it out stuff like the... All of that's missing Stone Cold's mouth. It doesn't make sense. He hasn't figured out how to miss or how to win more than five of his last 18 games. Yet in the last year, the Jaguars are five and 13. Let that sink in. It seems like Doug has got some stuff that he's got to figure out himself. Or Shad should finally just listen to everybody because I know you kind of feel the deja vu of hearing it. It's time for a fresh start, but time and time again, He's decided to go with the soft rebuild. One guy here, one guy there. You gotta keep continuity. But it's time to just go on ahead and, and break the broken record. They gave him those big scissors when they cut over the Mill and Loyal Electric Center. He can use that to just cut cord, press the reset button. It's time to clear everything out. Or maybe we can just borrow the phrase from Doug and Shad just can't seem to figure it out.